In today's video, I surprised my girlfriend by taking her on a little trip to the south of Japan to one of the most famous hot spring towns in the whole country. We take a nice little luxury cruise, I take her to some beautiful hot springs, and we stay at a traditional Japanese inn. And she has no idea any of this is about to happen. So yeah, enjoy. Greetings, friends. Welcome back to Japan, where today we are painfully hungover after indulging all kinds of sinning last night at the baseball game. <laughs> my lovely lady Sarah once again and uh, we're going on a little adventure today we're going on a little side quest she doesn't know where we're going if you were to guess what would you say um, what do you think we're about to do I don't know you always have tricks up your sleeve that are not what I am expecting yeah yeah every time you surprise me I have no idea Wait, no no it's this one, it's this one. sorry 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 I think you're really gonna like this you guys are watching the video, you already know. You've seen the title, you know what we're doing. But uh, this little lady has no idea. No, I'm so excited. Yeah? We've been struggling today, though. We're, we're quite hungover from all the sinning we did last night. Yes, 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 yes. There's aquarium stuff everywhere. Are we doing a uh, night at the museum, but at the aquarium? <laughs> aquarium walk-in? Uh-oh. For adults? I know. Her guesses are way better than the actual thing. <laughs> That's how you know you fucked up, boys. Uh, yeah. <laughs> we'll see. If we can find outside in this train station, I don't know where is outside. It's one of the worst feelings traveling in Japan. You just feel like you're stuck in these stations. All right, look at this dingy station, though. Are your hopes being lowered? Derelict. Derelict. <laughs> please lower your expectations, please. Okay, <laughs> just all right. We're gonna sleep in the subway station, right? right. Now we face a problem, it is raining hard. And we have a 15 minute walk. Really? So I think we should get a text. I do too. Yeah. Oh my God, it's really raining. Go. Run, run with your suit. Ah. Jesus. Wow. Wait, Sarah, have you looked at a map or anything? Do you know, no. do you have any idea where we are right no, now? No, I have not. All right, no. sweet. Jesus Christ. I haven't seen rain like this since Nam. <laughs> this? King Taxi better pick us up. I'll go run out and then if he says yes, I'll send a signal. Okay. <sighs> sir. 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 Please, sir. <laughs> We're desperate, sir. I'm wearing flip flops and socks in the rain. Hi, arigato gozaimasu. Sumimo san, arigato gozaimasu. Arigato gozaimasu. All right, sir. Thank you, thank you. Oh, yeah. Look at the cloth seat covers. Arigato. Okay. I think Sarah might figure out where we're going when I show this guy. It's, I still don't know. We're going to China. <laughs> no, it's. Uh, okay. She still has no idea. No. No idea. What an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now we got a little ASMR car ride. The rain in Japan. Cue the lo-fi music. <laughs> All right. What are we doing, puppy? <laughs> are we getting on a boat to go to China? Is that what's happening? A cargo ship? T terminal uh, Ichiban. Oh, hi, hi, hi. Here? I guess so. Okay. Hi. Ooh. Ah, okay. Hey. Nice. Thank you. Okay. Johnny, I got those animals. Bye bye. Are we going on a cargo ship? This is like shipping. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> you see it now? <laughs> Are we going on this cruise? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Feast your eyes. Oh my. On the sunflower. Oh, okay. sunflower Osaka. <laughs> That's so special. Yeah. Hey. Oh, I can't wait. Yeah. Can't wait. Yeah, babe. Osaka Harbor Cruise? Oh, yeah. Oh, fun. Overnight cruise. I love a boat and you're good to me. I was a little worried about the rain. It's been raining so hard. I'm like, is the water gonna be? Ooh. I don't know. We'll see. It's gonna be perfect. 
Yeah, there's a f***ing river happening on the stairs right now. I feel like this is probably the worst day we could have taken a boat, but I already <laughs> we pre-booked this weeks ago, so. Also in the area that we're going, which you don't even know where we're going, no. but the area that we're headed has been having like severe floods lately too, so. <laughs> okay. But it's over now. Ah. I think. <laughs> I don't know if this is the right confirmation email. I, there's just a number, so. <laughs> And he's not going to speak English. Yeah, and then I guess we'll get the ticket. Well, but look, we're on time. We're with the masses. That's good. See, I can be on time for stuff. I can plan. You kill us every time. Oh, ticket counter. Okay, perfect. Also, that's so Japanese of them to be like, oh no, wait, you have to go somewhere else to get a ticket and then vouch it just seems weird to me and like oddly too much work they love protocol in japan they love protocol i feel like it'd be so much easier to just put us on the boat i just uh we'll get to fill in some paperwork <laughs> what is this monstrosity jesus all right here we go reservation oh i got the line moss are they highlighted where our room is? Oh, that's nice. Oh, that's amazing. Onsen wa ya ikura desu ka? Tada desu. Oh, free. Oh. There's an onsen on the ship. Let's go. <laughs> yes. Segoi, segoi, segoi. Okay, arigato gozaimasu. Thank you. Everything's going so smoothly. Why is it that every time we walk away from people, they laugh? They walk away and they start giggling immediately. <laughs> it's right. I'm fine with being the brunt of a joke here. That's totally fine. Okay, so there you go. There's two there. All right, we came prepared now. So sorry to disappoint you earlier, sir. I look up to you as a father figure. Arigato gozaimasu. Thank you. Bye bye. And we're the last ones on board. That is troubling. <laughs> Anxiety inducing. Wow, Jesus wow. Christ, look at this monstrosity. Huge. Oh my goodness. Can't even get the whole thing in the shot. This thing's enormous. Yeah, so we're going to a place called Betu. It's a hot spring town in the south of Japan. Never been. Heard great things. Sarah has no idea where we're going. Look at her up there. She has no idea. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Guys, get you a woman who will fan you. <laughs> I don't know what this is about. The drawbridge is up apparently. If it wasn't for this one Japanese woman in front of us, I would feel like we were late and we fucked up royally. Yeah. If she was not here, I would think that they were like I'm gonna pull out. Yeah. Oh, the moment of truth. I got those animals. Wow. Oh, the captain welcoming us. What's up? I got those animals. Yeah. Wow. Look how freaking nice it is! Oh my god! This is freaking nice! I have goosebumps! Oh my god! The staircase? Oh, this is nice! A map of something? I don't know. Wow! Even the windows are like nautical, like classic ship looking. Love them. Yeah. Beautiful. Looking out on the muggy, gross port. What are these? Like interactive? Oh. Please touch. Oh, yeah. weather, the shops. Oh, the restaurant, they have vacancies in there. Hours for everything. That's when we're arriving. Yeah, also on our little thingies, I don't know if you guys saw earlier, but they have like, they have like staggered entrance times for like the, the spa in here, which is complimentary, the restaurant. Lights out time, which I, feel, I find crazy that they're like, Lights out by 10. Yeah, policing <laughs> us on when to go to sleep. With they're us. gonna put tape on the doors, like <laughs> on like field trips. No, like in uh, in Wuhan, China, they're gonna fucking weld, <laughs> weld the door shut. <laughs> it's so freaking useful. They put a map on here with where our rooms are and they've highlighted it. So this is Sarah's room, I think. Yeah, we had to get separate rooms because we're not married. <laughs> so, you know, gotta keep it PG here. Oh my God, am I in a dorm? I thought I got the private room. Maybe you're in a suite. No, mine's cheaper than yours. You got the nice one. Yeah. <laughs> wow. 
I feel like such a elegant whore here. Oh my god, this is so nice. That's the that's the spa. Incredible. Oh, beer vending machines. Very affordable prices. It's like a dollar. So many beer vending machines. Hot cocoa coffee vending machine. And they're affordable too. Like I feel like if this was in America, this would be like six, seven dollars for a beer. But this is like actually it's a dollar. Like strawberry hot cocoa. Mmm. Sounds disgusting. Alright, here we are. I really hope this is not a dorm, but I think it is. Oh my f***ing god. Blue light. Alright, I didn't like it. Blue light. Hey, how are you doing this? Oh shit. Oh wait, what the f***? This is nice as shit. What the f***? This is so nice. Oh, dude. This is not bad, bro. This is not bad. Oh my god. They have a television light vest, apparently. Oh wow, all the amenities you could ever want. It's very narrow, as you can see, I barely fit in here. Complimentary toothbrush? Thing for the onsen to cover my dick and balls. Earphones. Fuck yeah, dude. Oh my god. Dude, this is not too bad, honestly. Alright, so this was like, uh, this was about $100 for one night. And we're going all the way to Beppu. So on the Shinkansen, on the, uh, the bullet train, that would normally cost like $130, $140. Dollars. So this is actually a cheaper option. And I feel like it's a much more interesting way to travel in Japan. Even though I do love the Shinkansen. But feast your eyes. $100 a night. Plus it's all the other shit we get access to on the boat. Welcome to MTV Cribs. <laughs> Boo. <laughs> oh my god, we have a bathroom in your room? Look, oh rocks. my god. Oh my god, I'm using this. <laughs> I don't think so. I'm sh in this bathroom. Mm, no. <laughs> you don't have a key. So. Oh. <laughs> you can't come in here to take your poops. What are you talking about? Number one in here only. Okay. Sure, Welcome to my sure. bedroom. Nice, you got a desk? Oh my god, yeah. fancy. Did you get a toothbrush? I got a toothbrush and okay. toothpaste. Hey, do you have a refrigerator? I do not have a refrigerator. This is nice. It is nice. You got a big te television too. I know. Jesus. I opened the door and I was like, oh my god, this is half the size of the room in Osaka. And then mm -hmm. I was actually surprised. I mean, it doesn't feel that bad in here. Yeah, I mean, it's small, but I mean, it's also a ship. Yeah. The Japanese have mastered the art of squeezing a lot of stuff into a small space, but keeping it clean. I'm really amazed at how nice it is, actually. Like, I feel like they've renovated it recently. Like, everything looks so new and yeah, clean. The and the bathroom is nice. It is a very nice bathroom. Yeah. You got a bidet in this bitch? Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> oh, that's what I'm talking about. You think you're better than me in your nice room? Yeah? Is that a yes? <laughs> no, of course not. How's your dorm? Come check it out. Ooh. But there's no girls allowed after lights out, so oh, okay. gotta be quick. Yeah. yeah, I love the propaganda soundtrack <laughs> playing throughout the whole cabin. Sunflower. Sunflower. Alright, here we are. QR code to get in, it's very exclusive. Yeah. Does this look like a dorm to you? No, this is nice actually. This is freaking nice. Yeah. Wow. I know. This is great. Step inside. It's literally the only difference is you don't have the bathroom. Or a desk. Or the desk. But or still. a nice television, but you know. Look at this little cabinet. It's so cute, isn't it? Oh no, the life vest. That's my there. amenity. I have a life vest. <laughs> a life saving device. <laughs> I mean, it's literally the space of a closet, but I feel like it's it pretty is. damn nice, honestly. This was the cheapest room, too. Wow, okay. And so, like, this is the lowest quality you can get on this ship. Actually, there is a little dorm dorm. Really? But, yeah, yeah. Like, with bunk beds? Uh, yeah. Huh. They have curtains. Gosh, but. this is great. It's It doesn't feel like a dorm at all. This is, like, a legit privacy. Yeah, it is. I'm very surprised. Although, I can't say I'm too surprised with the quality of the Japanese <laughs> budget room. I feel like this is on par with the country. It's the greatest country in the Damn world. Don't you ever forget it. What's your bathroom situation like? Um, I have a corner. <laughs> Can't be pissing on the corner. <laughs> <laughs> well, I just figured I'd use your bathroom. And they have these nice massage chairs that mm. overlook the friggin' 
ocean? Yeah. Looks like it's uh, 200 yen for 15 Ooh, minutes. What a steal. That's pretty good. Oh, they have a smoking room for all your smoking needs? This place is freaking nice. I love a spa. This is oh, affordable too. This is cheaper than the Shinkansen. This is cheaper than the bullet train. What? Yeah, for a hotel room basically. Wow. Yeah. And honestly, like this, this like public area is like really nice and new. And I thought the rooms are gonna be kind of shitty, but everything is so nice and so new. It's got that new boat smell, doesn't it? It does, yeah. <laughs> and everything in here is so affordable. Like a bottle of wine over here is like 15, 16 dollars. In America, I feel like it would just jack up the price. Yeah. But I feel like here is like they're so courteous. Oh, well, they got the individual beer. Shout out Japan, bro. It's like the same price as it would be in a convenience store too. Like they don't mark up anything. That. I can't believe that. Oh. Only one left. You dirty dog. <laughs> it's only 700 yen. It's Gosh. like five bucks. That's like five dollars. It's 80 proof. That's <laughs> insane. After all the sins we committed last night, I don't know if we should. It's take. a no for me. Yeah. For now. Yeah. For now. <laughs> for now. I will regenerate. It's fucking like a true alky. <laughs> so we got some Takoyaki flavored Pringles. Takoyaki is like the, the famous fruit from Osaka. Like a little octopus ball. Sounds terrible. It's very delicious. Ooh. Oh, a parking lot. Oh my god. Though. Eh, eh. Bye bye, Osaka. Bye bye. I wonder if we can go up top. You think we can go up higher? I don't know. Oh, eh. oh my god. Though. Wow. All right. Oh my god! This is fantastic! I'm king of the world! Whoa! Say goodbye to Osaka, guys. It's been real. Next stop is uh, Beppu. What's in Beppu, Sarah? Do you have any idea? I don't know, but I'm excited <laughs> to find out! This is gonna take about 12 hours. We got 12 hours on the ship to so okay. go to the restaurant, maybe get a glass of wine, Aww. go to the spa. Mm -hmm. Romantic shipyard. Ah, look at the cargo holds. Yeah, and you can see the mountains in the distance. The city over there, a Ferris wheel, obviously. Always a Ferris wheel, man. You see a thing over there. No. Oh, shit. Oh, this gives me Titanic vibes. Yeah. The big red, whatever the fuck that is. Oh my god, Takoya Key Pringles. Wow, I'm really on my influencer shit, reviewing obscure snacks in Japan. <laughs> hey guys, a lot of you have been asking me about my diet in Japan, and it's only Takoyaki Pringles. Oh, those are delightful. Tastes just like it. Yeah, savory, mm. salty, a little sweet, it's delicious. Mm. These are so good. How did they do that? I don't know. I feel like the Pringles are slightly smaller here too. They look wow. humorous in my gigantic Neanderthal hands. This is how you know it's not a tourist trap. Like, there's no English. Well, dinner buffet. That's about it. I mean, are you ready to eat a buffet? Maybe we can also choose something else on these vending machines. <laughs> oh my god. No English. No fing English. Oh shit. Hopefully, they have pictures. Okay. See if those symbols match up. So this is 600. Wow, we are really just comparing the symbols on here to that sign. I don't know. I'm clueless. Hey, don't ask me. Hi. I'm just gonna have to free ball it. Okay. All right. Yeah. Hell yeah. We're doing it. We're figuring it out. All right. We have successfully secured the bag. We are not fully. We figured out how to feed ourselves on this boat. Oh shit, son. I got the seafood and noodles with the shrimp, broccoli, squid. Sarah got the curry. Damn, I think Sarah might have beaten this today, boys. That looks much better. You <laughs> keep taking? <laughs> I think uh, you might have beaten me on the, on the meal haul. Mine looks questionable. Okay. I'm not sure what's in there. And it also does not look very filling. So I'm probably going to have to go back and, and re up. I don't like it. Alright, now it's time to try the forbidden true high, the pineapple. I've never seen this in all my time in Japan. Probably for good reason. I feel like it's going to be disgusting. But 
one in Rome. Oh wait, that's actually delightful. It tastes like real pineapple juice. That is incredible. Oh my God, that's the best chew high. That's the best one by far, not even close. Who would have thunk? All right, so next we're going into the spa. Can't really show you guys uh, much in here because of what with it being a spa and everything. Yeah, I see they have a no tattoo sign. They're very strict about that in, uh, in the spas of Japan. Well, can't really show you guys much in here. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. Mandatory announcements. It's 5.30 in the morning and they turned the lights on and then we'll shut the f up over the intercom. <sighs> All right, everybody, say goodbye to our $100 hotel room that I could not sleep in. <sighs> Today might be a rough day. Let's see how Sarah's doing. Hello. How'd you sleep? Good. Yeah? Really? You slept good? Yeah. Good. You seem fresh. I'm feeling good. Fresh as a daisy. Yeah, I'm ready to go. I'm excited nice. to see what you have planned. <laughs> I didn't sleep great, I'm not gonna lie. Really? Yeah, they turned the light on in the dorm area. Oh. And I uh, couldn't go back to sleep after that. So I went to the spa. You did? Yeah. So here we have what you might think is a sink. It looks like a sink. It acts like a sink, but it says flush. Hmm. Why does it say flush on a sink? Well, that's because please use if become seasickness. It's a seasick sink, and it flushes to put your vomit down the drain. <laughs> that's incredible. Japan is light years ahead of us. A little sink in there, and I saw it was like graded, and then I saw it was in a stall. Wait, the sea sickness sink is in a stall. Ours is in, in a stall, so you can puke in private. Wow. Mm -hmm. And it had all the same stuff uh, on the side as the bidet, so you could turn on the noise. No if, way. Yeah. Oh my god, the privacy, like yeah. the little bird chirping. Uh -huh. Yeah, bird oh chirping, water god. running. That's incredible. I love it. Yeah, ours is just out in the open. It's just like <laughs> in the middle of everything. I guess I guess men have less self-respect or yeah. Any self-respect in the moment wouldn't throw up <laughs> in the uh, the open bathroom, I guess. Yeah, I guess you gotta mask all your problems as a woman, you know? <laughs> with sound and, and out of sight. Sure you wouldn't like to start your day with a strawberry hot cocoa? Um, I think I would prefer a beer instead. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Actually, when I came out here earlier, all the beer and stuff, they weren't allowing people to buy it. Really? Like, yeah, they, it was all red, like, oh. indicating sold out, but... Yeah, yeah, but no, remember we saw on the TV, uh, it had the hours that you were allowed to get alcohol on the ship. Oh. And they stopped selling the alcohol after 11 p.m., and I didn't look at the opening because uh. I'm not an alcoholic. But... <laughs> well, it's open now. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently, if it's after 6 a.m., it's fine. <laughs> Get whatever you want, sweetheart, on me. Wow. <laughs> there you go. You can't go wrong. All the other coffee's fucking terrible. It's only like six ounces of coffee, but I feel like it's very strong in Japan. This will give you a heart attack. I think Sarah's feeling spunkier than I am. I'm ready to go. <laughs> <laughs> do you have any idea what we're gonna do today? No, no, I have no clue. <laughs> Made it hard to get dressed this morning, but. Oh yeah? I'm ready. All right, I like this. This is like a nice adventure outfit. Yeah, multi For the summer. Utility. Yeah. This is a ladies utility suit on sale now. <laughs> <laughs> With the Louis Vuitton bag and all. <laughs> That's funny. It's just good sense. It's practical. Yeah. Boom, Metro card. Exactly. Boom, beer. <laughs> all right, let's enjoy our $1 coffee. Uh, tastes like mediocrity. It's actually not that bad. This is the best one we've had. I don't know, to me it tastes like freezer burned. It tastes like gross. I don't, I don't like it. It's watery, but it's better than all the other ones that are so sweet. Well, one thing I do appreciate about Japan is you can buy black coffee in a can. Like in America, you can't do that. Well, it's like much more rare. Yeah. It's always like sugary fucking frappuccinos and lattes, but this is just like straight up yeah. caffeine. Coffee. Hey. Wow. <laughs> That's Beppu. 
Babu. Such a cute word. Oh, it's here. Hey. Arigatouzaimasu. Now our first look at Babu. Why you can see all the hot springs, the thermal springs in the distance there. <laughs> you have no idea what's gonna happen. <laughs> You're right, I have no idea, but I'm very excited. <laughs> I like to look at those mountains. Yeah. I like the smell of that ocean. I'd say we uh, take a taxi. It's only like five minutes away. Okay. Yeah, we can drop our stuff. Yeah, no disrespect to this taxi driver, but he looks bad. His tie is on inside out somehow. His pants are falling down. He hasn't buttoned a single button on his sleeves. I've never seen a taxi driver look like this in Japan, so I was really surprised to see this gentleman picking us up at like 6 o'clock in the morning. I was almost certain he had just gone on a late night bender. As I must. About to find out where we're going. I can't wait. Any ideas? Any guesses? No, none. Really? Mountain. No. Ocean, mountain. mountain. It's very Japan. Ocean, mountain. <laughs> Stock. Doesn't really tell you much here. It is beautiful, actually. It kind of looks like Halong Bay. Bye, bye, sunflower. Sunflower. We'll never forget you. <laughs> we'll never forget your annoying <laughs> song. Yeah. <laughs> well, it's much more tropical here. You see the palm trees. We went many 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 kilometers south we went far south yeah i, I would really like to look at a map when will that be allowed? no maps allowed <laughs> it's fine because i can't find japan on a map anyway <laughs> it's because you're american we don't have maps in america recent polls have shown a fifth of americans can't locate the u.s on a world map why do you think this is i personally believe that u.s americans are unable to do so because uh, some people out there in our nation don't have maps and I believe that our ed education like such as in South Africa and uh, the Iraq everywhere like such as and thank you very much South Carolina any clues are we going on another boat are we going to the beach is that the beach there I mean it's the ocean I wouldn't say it's a beach yeah no guesses. We'll be there in two minutes. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want you to get it right. <laughs> so we just pulled up. I feel like Sarah might know what it is now. Is this a spa? Could be. What's that one? Ryken? Ryken? Ryokan? Ryokan? Is that this is? Damn it, damn it, damn it. I guess white girls are all born with a natural ability to sniff out spas from 300 yards away. I was an idiot to think I could keep this from her. Um, no, those are, oh, Jesus. Sorry, sir. I could not have gone anywhere. You almost had one less hand. Jesus Christ. Wow, this man hung over. Disheveled, disheveled man. Is this a love hotel? <laughs> Brought you all the way here. <laughs> How many hours are we paying for? <laughs> Two minutes. That's all I need. <laughs> Oh yeah. Oh, this is classy. Oh my god. Oh, it smells amazing in here. This is really nice. Wow. Good day, Mom. Good We have a reservation. Yes. Can we leave our bags here? Yes. Cute little outfit. <laughs> Do you know where we are? No. Tell me details. You don't know where we are? No. I don't know what this is. <laughs> Hotel. <laughs> I like it better this way. <laughs> These are so cute too. These oh, all the little shoes. Little like wooden sandals. Yeah, yeah. A little rock garden. Ooh, <laughs> we're about to get our zen on. <laughs> this is actually a, a cult we're we're joining oh, together. Perfect. Okay, good. Yeah. yeah. I just really needed you for the the sign up incentive. So. Oh. <laughs> I thought you were gonna say for the sacrifice. <laughs> well, that too. <laughs> What kind of cult would it be without sacrificing a beautiful blonde woman? <laughs> I actually like the fact that you don't know what this is. I was like, oh, I'm going to spoil it when we go here. No. And I don't know enough about Japanese culture to know what we walked into. Is this a spa? Ryokan? Is that this is? Uh, it smells like a spa. Feels like a spa. <laughs> Looks like a spa. Is it a spa? <laughs> You'll see. <laughs> All right, let's go on a little day trip. Okay. I got something planned. <laughs> Ladies, don't settle. <laughs> 
So in America, we have family planning. Here they have car and life planning. Equally important, don't defund car and life planning. All right, we're walking to our mystery location. A scenic, beautiful view. It reminds me of an exit off of interstate in America. <laughs> what do you guys think, abandoned or not abandoned? We cannot tell. There's so many buildings here that are covered in ivy and moss and stuff. And I feel like we're just in a very like tropical part of the world where things are growing, baby. Yeah, if it's not rusted out, it's covered in plant life. Jesus Christ. There's lights on. I guess people live there or hotel, I don't know. Yeah. Not Maybe. abandoned. Sean Flower. <laughs> Sean Flower. <laughs> ah. Don't ask questions, just walk towards the smoke. <laughs> Walk towards the smoke. Seems safe. <laughs> Good idea. Charge forward. No uh. information. <laughs> this is the cult headquarters. Oh. <laughs> the fires are the sacrifices or the incense. <laughs> Triggered by my Catholic upbringing. I'll be honest with you, sir. I've never been here, so I, this could be wrong. We're going to find out together, though. The cross key button. Yeah. Do you think that actually does something? I do, yeah. Because things work in this country, not like our country. I was going to say, I don't know about Japan, but I know in America, most of the time, these are not real. They're all sure for show. Yeah, see? Here we go. Oh. Take a right. John Flower. Shit, I hope this is it. I see tour buses. Tour buses. We're going to tour a factory. Ooh. Look at that vibe, though. It's the and yeah. the castle, what is this? clouds, and the mist in the background. Beautiful. New parking lot. Ooh. Yeah. I brought you here for the parking lot. This is beautiful paved blacktop. Thank you. Man, I hope we get to see some Chinese tourists today in groups of 500 <laughs> spitting and shouting and smoking everywhere. Oh, yeah. How's I How's I must? Okay. All right. Wow, I love how you still don't know what this is. No. I mean, I saw some pictures of monkeys and stuff. Is it a zoo? Could be. Okay. <laughs> Can we get the sea hell? Mm -hmm. oh, okay, this. Sea hell? We're seeing hell? <laughs> <laughs> I got the lame, uh, thank you. Yeah. Oh shit, I didn't get shamed. Oh my god. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, I'm not in this year. Oh, this is not. Oh, this is not. I was just so excited. Okay, what are we doing? What is that? Just look around. Is it? It's thermal vents, hot springs. Ooh, I smell salt. Walk this way. Oh, cute. It, oh, it's like a botanical garden. I'm not gonna say anything. <laughs> botanical garden with thermal vents. Here's where we want to go. Yeah, Sarah's a big researcher and planner, and I feel like she's it's torture for me. <laughs> I'm not even letting her look at the pamphlet. Yeah. <laughs> he literally snatched it out of my hand. <laughs> Use your five senses. Use your five senses. I'm seeing and smelling and tasting a lot of stuff. You should jump in there. That's where the, the factory is though. I don't want to bother the Chinese children. Oh. <laughs> <sighs> Yeah, natural hot springs. Wow, they're so cool. Wow, they're bright red. Yeah, they're called uh, hell. They're called hells. There's like seven of these big, big baths. These natural, naturally sulfuric baths. It's like the biggest concentration of hot springs in all of Japan here in Beppu. Oh, that's this what it's is known for. Awesome. Yeah. I love hot springs. I love nature. This is perfect. Yeah. You knew what this was all along, then. Oh yeah. Yeah, I was like. Yeah, because the clues are everywhere, because these are all over the city. Like, if you look at the skyline, there's a million of these vents, these okay, thermal well, vents everywhere. To be fair, when you're driving through, like, the Midwest, the United States, you also see white smoke billowing <laughs> up everywhere. Sure, yeah. yeah. It's crazy. It looks fake, but it no, it's fake. boiling water right there. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> it is a spa day. <laughs> I'm going to smell like a fart at the end of this. Uh... Oh my god, it's so it hot. It is really oh, hot. Holy crap. Really hot. It does look fake, doesn't it? I've never seen lily pads that size either. It's like I could stand on one of those. That's enormous. It's like four feet across, three, four feet across. 
Oh my God. Jesus Christ. Oh my God. This is incredible. Oh. Are they making eggs in there? Or <laughs> I think they are. I think they're cooking eggs. Oh my God, I bet those are so good for you. <laughs> Holy shit. This looks like something out of a movie. Blue Gatorade. Blue Gatorade, yeah. Even the sand. The sand. What even is that? I don't even know, dude. That's insane. It seems like some kind of CGI. Yeah. It's incredible. Oh my god, be careful. The ground is like wet here from all the steam. Whoa, dude. Oh my god, it's actually like wet. It's moist. This is crazy. Even the rock formation looks fake. Yeah. What the hell? It's like blown out of the sides, like someone like hitting a bong or something. <laughs> you know? Yeah. It's just pouring out of there. Oh, this is so cool. Yeah? I love it. I yeah, like it. I really do. I like it so much. Oh my God. It's so atmospheric. Can't you feel it? I feel like we're in a Hollywood movie. I feel like we're on the set of some Disney ride. We're like waiting in the queue to go on the ride. And this is all made up. It's actually not though. All these rocks are natural from the volcano that exploded over a millennia ago. And this, this uh, rock path is um, older than the volcano itself. It's actually, nah, I'm just kidding, it's not. It's so atmospheric. You got your blue pond, you got your steam, volcanic rock, white girls taking Instagram reels. There's a little bit of everything here. <laughs> This is so nice, so picturesque. Wow. This is a far departure from the normal video of mine where I'm <laughs> wading through piles of trash in India. I was but just thinking that. <laughs> this is actually like nice. <laughs> <laughs> for drinking? No, do not drink that. Oh. It's for like washing your face or your hands. Oh, okay. Yeah. Won't do that. Look. Who needs Fushimi and Ari in Kyoto when you have these thingies? Oh, cool. So much good fortune coming our way. Oh, a little shrine. Look at that. Yeah, the Japanese uh, have a religion called Shintoism. It's like animist, where they kind of pay homage to like natural processes and whatnot. So I'm actually not surprised that there is a shrine here next to the most bubbling hot spring in all of Japan. Pretty sweet. Pretty f thick. Got beers on there that somebody left? Yeah, sake, wine maybe. Yeah. As an like, offering to the gods. Yeah, honestly, the blue water is like so tempting. I really just want to get in there. Throw me in with those eggs, dude. Cakes, apparently. Oh yeah, they're cakes. Apparently they're cooking cakes in there. I don't know why, but it just looks so appealing, doesn't it? The shrine in the back, the blue water. I just want to jump in and kill myself, guys. It looks so refreshing. I know my skin would boil off to a crisp. The sulfur would burn me alive. But it wouldn't be such a bad way to go, would it? It wouldn't be so bad. They'd remember you forever. Yeah, I feel like if it's not already obvious, the, the steam is from the boiling water. It's like 210 degrees and it's just shooting out of the earth. It's such an amazing place. Let's do one and see how it is. Okay. Uh, Hitotsu Aobiru. Oh, actually, you don't want to try. Let's go. Uh, Futatsu. Futatsu. Yeah. So they serve like a special beer here, a blue beer. Oh, Jesus. Oh, I guess to signify the hells. Come fight. Wow, I feel like such a tourist. Mm -hmm. It smells normal. Oh no. Oh. Oh, that's terrible. <laughs> I like why I said, get two, we're gonna like it. I can taste the food coloring. Wow, this is, this is bad. It's not good. Should we take it outside? Should we take it to the seasickness sink? <laughs> it's just so bad. Yeah, it's not good. It's horrible. Maybe, um, <laughs> maybe this is part of the experience. They pulled the sulfur taste out of the hot spring and put it in this beer. Yeah, they probably like just scooped it in the f***ing bath. Put like a teaspoon of beer into it and then... It's hard to drink. 
It's really bad. It's yeah. one of the worst things I've ever drank in my life. Yeah. <laughs> This is easily the worst beer I've ever had. Yeah, and we've been to frat parties. <laughs> <laughs> they got us though, the tourist trap worked. They trapped us. <laughs> what happened was we got here super early and we can't check into our hotel. So we said, let's drink some beer at 10 a.m. <laughs> Don't tell them what time it is. <laughs> it's 2 p.m. guys. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> No, it says Oita Chabaco, green tea powder sticks. Hey, you put it into your... Oh! What? Why does it look like a cigarette? Why is it called Chabaco? Yeah, look at the boys just enjoying some Chabaco. That's ridiculous. Why do they... Is it a tobacco product? No, it's green powder tea sticks. That yeah. is random as hell. This is uh, marketing to men. They chose a lane and they committed to it. <laughs> if you want to be white and look cool and have a nice jawline and wear a shirt with one button undone on the top, <laughs> then use Chewbacca. <laughs> what a ridiculous product. I want it. Control quest. Oh, Jesus Christ. He's in a bag. Looks like he's been killed by the mafia. Hang loose, bro. Sorry about your death and everything. <laughs> Even his haircut is scaring me. It's like a 1980s good boy haircut. I don't know what's happening here. It's like a layer of like milky gloopy lead and like shattered rock looking shit. Wow, I'm a terrible tour guide. Yes, yeah, so we just left the, um, the thermal hot springs and we find ourselves on another thing of hot springs. Literally just right off the road here. They just have a, a foot bath where you can uh, just soak your feet. See? Local bath for free. It's just here on the side of the road, it's incredible. I've never seen a hot spring culture like this. Have you ever seen anything like this? No, it's so cool. It really reminds me, I was just saying, of ancient Rome. Like, the fact that this still exists here, it's like such a social, cultural thing. It's so cool. Mm -hmm. All right. Mm. So we're just pulling up to one of the most famous restaurants in Beppu. Known for their fried chicken and sushi, apparently. Let's see, looks very unassuming. I think this is it. <laughs> We're too fing big for this country, look. We're squeezed in here. We're touching. Ew. We're touching this girl. Ew. <laughs> I'm gonna develop so many back problems here, sitting on the floor. <laughs> How am I supposed to eat, dude? Just like lean over. How am I supposed to? What do they expect me to do? The cold towel. Oh, so refreshing on a hot summer day. Mmm. Oh. The attention to detail in this country, the customer service is unparalleled. Oh my god. Tempura chicken, very delicately fried. It looks like much lighter than normal fried chicken. Yeah. Got a little set here. I have no idea. Some kind of soup. Oh yeah. Okay, I got those same uh, crab butter. Whoa. I thought it was gonna be crab in butter, not butter from the crab. <laughs> what is that? It looks like a pile of shit. I don't know, but I thought the same thing as you. Butter from the crab. That sounds like diarrhea or something. <laughs> it's his innards. It's oh his, my god. It's his fluids. <laughs> it sounds. Okay, now you're you're selling me once again. I think I want to try it. <laughs> yeah, so this is a special fried chicken from this region where they like douse it in garlic and miso, I think. That's probably wrong, but it's like a very local recipe. What is this, mustard? Ooh, I hope it's the wasabi mustard. It is, it is Ooh. spicy. Spicy like spiced or spicy like hot? Wasabi hot. Mm. Wasabi spicy. Ooh. Ooh. Holy moly. Is that a strong oh, shit. <laughs> I think you dip it in the soy sauce, eh? <coughs> oh my god, it's so spicy. Mmm. <coughs> oh, oh, it's good. It is so juicy. Oh my god. And this is what I love about Japanese food. Like, all the traditional foods come out in like small little portions. They have a little taste of everything. It's incredible. What do you think? So good, yeah. It's crispy, but not too crispy. It's like really juicy. The flavor's great. This mustard, wasabi mustard, is crazy. All right, well, I've successfully crushed my meal. Sarah's another story. 
It's really filling, the food here. Shame. Shame, Shame on my whole family. <laughs> so now it's time to eat the um, crab butter. <clears throat> the beloved dish of Oita. No, I'm just kidding. I have no idea. Oh, wait, what? Mm. I am dreading this because I thought it was going to be a crab soaked in butter, but now it's just... <laughs> oh, it's all right. It's like crab, like it. I was gonna say it's like tuna salad, but with crab. Really? It stinks. Yeah, it smells bad. My breath smells bad now. I can smell like it. Throw up. It looks like dog shit. Really? <laughs> nope. Not for me. Stop it. I can't. <laughs> I can't. I've been programmed. <laughs> All right, we are rolling back up to our hotel about 40 minutes early. We'll see if they allow us to check in because we are filthy animals. So tired right now. Ooh. Oh, it's so cold. Oh, it smells so good. Sir, this is luxury. Wow. I feel like an expensive whore. See what I'm saying? Boom. Aggressive. Aggressive. I didn't know what was going on. Oh, yeah, I'm a good time. Ah, see what I'm saying? Hello. Um, we're back. We're, I know, we're a little early. Uh, yes. Is the room ready? Mm -hmm. Look at that. It's so official. Wow. Disappearing behind a magical door. I know. And the bags are in the room? Yes. yes. All right, awesome. Perfect. We can okay. Oh, yeah. This for medics, for women, you have socks and belts. Okay, thanks so much. We have socks. We have ice pack, complimentary ice yes. packs. Oh, cool. And the public press on this point and the left side. Perfect. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. Refrigerator mm. with free drinks and above the bus. The bus right now is hot. <gasps> uh, if you need that cool water, you can use this control. It's a cool water. Oh. Nice. Because it's uh, very hot right now. Okay. Dude. <laughs> <laughs> okay, sir. Thank you so much. Thanks. All right. Thank you, sir. Thank you. All right. Bye bye. Nice Cheers. You too. What do you think what? of the Let bath in, in the there. room? Oh, that's so cool. Look at it. Look oh, at it. yeah. Oh, my gosh. This is so cool. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> wow. Oh, yeah. Wow. Hooked it up. Hell, yeah. Let's see how hot it is. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it's nice. That's a nice temperature. Ooh. Oh man, this is amazing! Yeah, I knew you'd love it. I knew you'd love it. Wow! Yeah. This is so cool. Oh yeah. Look at it. We never need to leave the room. This is amazing. <laughs> yeah. Wow. So glad you like it. It's so pretty. Oh, nice. This is so cool. Oh, I yeah. love this for the towels. Mm -hmm. Is this the trash? Oh. Yeah. Hell yeah. This is so fancy. Nice hair dryer. Oh shit. It's like a missile. Ooh, okay. <laughs> yeah. You yeah. Listen. <laughs> the only thing is it doesn't have a shower, I think. There's a there's a Oh, there's a yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice. Yeah. Is that a Little stool that yeah, you gotta wash off in. before you get in there. Make sure you're clean. Is yep. the bucket? Yep. Oh my gosh. Oh yeah. This is so awesome. <laughs> wow. Yup. How did you find this place? <gasps> Love. Oh yeah, nice little tea set. Oh. It's nice. This is so wow. Cool. Even comes with like a nice pen. I'm stealing this. Yeah, we're gonna take this. Home. <laughs> this comes home with us. Got nice it. tatami floors. I literally can't wait for us to wear these outfits. Let's do it. Let's ah. fucking bathe. Wow. So you didn't know we were gonna stay in a no in the the Rio Con? No, I didn't. No, I thought that the hot spring was the surprise, and it was so cool. <laughs> yeah. You underestimate me. Big time. <laughs> this is amazing. 
I don't have yeah. words for this. So you didn't know this was a spa, like, when we walked in? I, it felt like a fancy hotel. Uh -huh. Yeah, they made you take off your shoes. Japan is, it's just like that. I'm, mm -hmm. I'll be honest, I don't know the significance of the removing your shoes. Just for cleanliness. Yeah, well, okay. I love that, so... Mm. Yeah, I no, I didn't really know. It smelled like a spa, but sometimes fancy hotels, it smells yeah. like spa in the lobby. Honestly, I was like, man, I feel like it's gonna be such a buzzkill because I'm gonna bring her here and she's gonna know it's a spa, and we're gonna have to think about it all day and then come back later. But it was great because no. you had no idea. No, no, I didn't know. I, I didn't assume anything. Also, we got up at like five in the morning, so we got here, we dropped our bags. Yeah. They were like, we'll take them, and then we left. I didn't think anything of it. Yeah. Other than that, it smelled amazing. All right. <laughs> We surprised her, boys. Good job. <laughs> We're gonna get in that tub. <laughs> oh wait, first, first, ah. first. I want to show you guys something. This is a delight. <laughs> Damn you, toilet! <laughs> Go back down. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's that's you stay there. All right, <laughs> take two, take two. <laughs> I have to show you guys something. My favorite feature, Sarah's all about the bath and blah, blah, blah. But here's the best part. Fuck. Oh yeah, it did it. Yes, yes. The toilet of all toilets. My throne, yeah. Press a button, roof go missing, know what I'm saying? Yeah, buddy. Wow. Oh yeah. I'll be in here if you need me, all right? <laughs> okay. You have fun in the back. Bye. <laughs> oh. oh my god. <laughs> this is luxury. <laughs> I was not ready for how relaxing that was gonna be. <laughs> oh my goodness. Feels so good. Were you surprised with today? I'm so surprised. This is like the best way to cap off our day though, or spend the rest of our day. This is amazing. It smells so good. It's so warm in here, <laughs> in a good way. Yeah, we checked in earlier and we are not leaving this hotel <laughs> room until tomorrow when they have to kick us out. So, <laughs> yeah. Until then, peace. If you're a small business owner, freelancer, or anybody who doesn't work a regular nine to five job, you pretty much need to have a website. A lot of people go on Fiverr and just hire a stranger to do it for them, but the truth is, even if somebody has hundreds of five-star reviews, you still don't know if they're legit or not. These days, just about anybody can fabricate hundreds of five-star reviews to seem like they're credible, only to find out they've scammed you for a couple hundred bucks. That's what happened to Sarah. The freelancer she hired basically destroyed her website that she had spent years working on. Trust me, man, when it comes to your own business, that thing is your baby. You don't wanna just give a stranger the reins and pray they're gonna do a good job. That's where Esso Digital Design comes in. Sarah will build you a website herself, either in one day or one week. She consults with you on exactly what you want, builds your entire website, including all the nitty gritty stuff you don't wanna deal with, then gives you another walkthrough of the site once it's all done. You're gonna have a banging ass website by the time she's done with it. But don't take my word for it. Check out the link in the description to see some of her previous work and take a look at what she has to offer. All right guys, see you in the next one. Peace.